Hi everyone, welcome to Mermaid Radio. You are listening to this week's Universal Energy Reading using the 16 Kauri and the Veve Prophecy Cards. I am Mami Olafunke. This reading is in effect from today, Monday, October 23rd through Sunday, November 5th, 2023. I thank you for joining me this week and I pray you find this information useful so you like subscribe add notifications to know when the next video is available let's get started the universal energy reading for the next two weeks c6 cowrie on the mat and osayen tambours in the veve prophecy card this reading calls for contracts that are going to be offered to you and that you do have to read the fine print carefully because most likely these will be marriage contracts prenuptial agreements uh, people will want to get married and and put it make it official that they are in a relationship and they will want to have contracts and hold you to those contracts so be sure that you can uh, live up to what's in the contract the next part of the reading, Ashe, the next part of the reading, see seven Kauri on the mat and Shango Agbao Rune in the Veve Prophecy cards. So here, uh, after the six Kauris, this says that you could be betrayed by one you trust. Shango, the arrogant, he fools around, you know, he's loose. Um, well, we call him loose here. He's not loose. He just has many wives and he's always looking for another one. And so, uh, when dealing with Shango, you can you might get caught up in him presenting himself one way. And then you find it out that it's another way. Akbal Rune is the ancestors. And in this case, they really uh, are not doing well at wrangling Shango so that you can be betrayed. Seven Cowrie says people are going to talk about you. They're going to gossip about you. And even to your face, they're going to say things to you that will make you upset. But you have to, you know, work your ovary, take soothing baths and chamomile jasmine you know some coconut some cooling uh essential liquids and refrain from being too emotional about things because you might miss the betrayal if you are you know if you're not careful uh Shay, the next part of the reading sees five cowrie on the mat and shango again olo dumare and here we have pride. You you might want to not worry about the contract because you think you're so beautiful. You know, like Oshun, you think you're so beautiful that you don't really have to. Nobody would do you any, any um, nobody would lie to you. Nobody would take advantage of you. But you could find yourself um, really out on a limb if you do not read that contract and make sure that you can agree to all that's written therein. <clears throat> you wouldn't want to push the contract aside and it says that this person has to take care of the ex-wife and the family within the house that you're going to live in. You know, so you, you have to be careful if you can't take that. I mean, if you can stand that, well, then you sign on the dotted line. So... Be careful of people telling you, oh, you look so beautiful. And, and you really, don't let your head, uh, don't let your head be swayed by flattery and uh, yes, people. Yes, yes, you look nice. Yes, yes, you should do that. Yes, yes. Be careful of yes, people. Think for yourself. Uh, if you're not sure, see your spiritual person and get some guidance on it. So you can make informed decisions about what you can and cannot do in this lifetime or it just in this situation. Ashe. 
This has been Mami Olufunke's Universal Energy Reading. I thank you for joining me this week. I put up my my next uh, logo artist statement. So I don't know if you like this one better or the one I had last video. Please let me know in the comments below. If you need a spiritual reading, uh, please let me know at mermaidbotanica at gmail.com. And you can also visit my website. I don't really have anything new on there, but for uh, it's happy Halloween time. It's happy Halloween. And I put out my, my two pumpkin, three pumpkins to, to celebrate. So these are some of my art pieces. I have these as shoe pieces and the Yamaya piece. This Yamaya piece is a collage. So I'm gonna hold it to the side. Maybe you can see that the, the Yamaya is stuck on top of the, of the canvas. And uh, this is Mermaid Mommy Collage 2. And she will be on the website if you like her along with some others. So this is uh, my artwork. This is Happy Fish in the Sunshine. And when I made, I looked at the title today, I said, indeed, this fish is happy. And that is some banging sunshine. So this piece is on the website as well. MermaidBotanica.com Thank you for joining me this week, everyone. I pray you find this information useful. Please like, subscribe, add notifications to know when the next video is available. Have a great two weeks. Odabo.